if there were an MVP, a hard trophy for the second half of the season, that team would have wanted it to go to UC Soros. They were dead in the water, and he caught fire. This is about more than just his save percentage, which was ridiculous from February 15th, Valentine's Day on. That's, of course, the 14th. But, Dano, the point I want to make to you as I look at your hulking frame and we talked with Jacob Chikrin, <laughs> he's 5'11". Andre Vasilevsky is 7'4". Okay? Along those lines. The goalies there. that everybody gets so excited about at the draft and in the league are these big guys. He's the opposite of that, and he's still covering the 4 by 6 Wow. Well, first off, it seems nowadays you're absolutely right, Tony, where if you're not 6'2", 6'3", at least in the Nets, then teams aren't drafting you because it's gone. Uh, it's evolved where these big goalies are athletic and cover more of the net. But UC Saros at 5'11", kind of... Uh, back, go back to my era where 5'11 guys excel. Look no further than a guy like Mike Richter, who's yes. one of the best in the game. But how does he do it? His quickness, his side to side movement, his athleticism. The guy doesn't quit on a play. And some of those highlights, are, give me goosebumps, are fun to watch. I mean, he, he is never out of a play, right? When it looks like the puck's going zipped across right to left and uh, he's out of it and there's a wide open half of the net while well, he gets across and makes the save. And that just shows uh, a guy that uh, has the will to compete as well. And you have to have that as a goaltender and a guy that is extremely quick, athletic, and just will stop the puck. That's what you got to do as a goaltender, it just seems we've gone uh, in the way of all big 6'3 and taller type goaltenders, but Saros still excelling at 5'11 and, and making those small goaltenders uh, uh, feel good about themselves and going, yeah, you can still be a small goaltender if you're a young player and, and have some success and make it to the best league in the world. And, oh, yeah, maybe be one of the top goaltenders in the league like UC Saros is. <laughs> no doubt. Pekka Rene cast a mighty long shadow. Figuratively and literally, Saros came out of that shadow this year.